Hello, this is Africa TV and you are watching the World Today News Bulletin. I am Amadou Kante. Many thanks for joining us. And now the news in detail and we begin matters with the WHO because the team of World Health Organization scientists arrived in Wuhan on Thursday to investigate the origins of the deadly coronavirus pandemic which emerged from the cities or the Chinese city in December 2019. This agreement between the WHO and China on the investigation of the novel coronavirus in Wuhan was announced in December last year. The CSA has more details of that in this report. It is believed that COVID-19 came from the selling animals in the Chinese city. As a result, a panel of World Health Organization scientists arrived in the central Chinese of Wuhan on Thursday to cooperate in the research on the origin of the pandemic. According to China's National Health Commission, the WHO team, which consisted of 10 experts from 10 different countries, will go through relevant quarantine procedures required under China's epidemic control measures before conducting their much-delayed mission to examine the origin of the pandemic. Their trip comes at a time when more than 20 million people are under lockdown in the North China and one province has declared an emergency, according to reports. Officials also said that China has recorded 87,536 total cases of the virus and more than 4,000 deaths. Hospitals are currently treating 673 people for COVID-19, while over 500 people are in isolation after testing positive without showing symptoms. This is the third such visit since the start of the novel coronavirus in China. Last year, China had visited WHO experts twice to carry out cooperation on tracing potential sources in the country, during which the two sides formulated a deal for China to be part of the Global Scientific Cooperation Plan. For iAfrica News, I am Daisy Zay.